Hey everybody, this is Black Sierra. I'm back with a new Diablo 3 video. And for the introduction of the new seasons, I created a new build and got back into Diablo. So I'm here showcasing my new build, my new character in the new season. So this build that I created is a lightning bully build. It allows you to get up close and tank and have a lot of survivability and put out a ton of damage. And as you guys might imagine, it's based around electricity damage. So I'll show you guys the skills. So its primary ability and its core really is the Arcane Torrent with Static Discharge. This provides a lot of single target damage as well as some AoE from the two piercing bolts spreading off the charge. Uh, next we have Blizzard with Lightning Storm. This gets, gives uh, some large AoE damage as well as the 15% increased damage from Lightning which is huge. And the third pillar of this build is the Black Hole Supermassive. And this just really allows me to group the enemies up and control them for a little while while AoE while I AoE them down. Sorry for those words. And then we have familiar spark flint, nothing too special there. Energy armor, energy tap, nothing too special there as well. And then here's a big change. We have magic weapon with conduit. And when you have conduit, enemies hit by your attacks restore three arcane power. This pretty much gives me infinite arcane power during battle. And this is huge for this build since it's so arcane power intensive. For my passive, we have Glass Cannon for more damage, Astral Presence for more arcane power, Audacity for additional damage because I'm doing a lot of tanking up close, and Unwavering, Unwavering Will too for more damage and resistance and armor uh, because this is mainly a stationary build. To look at my gear, there's really only one piece that truly defines this build. Uh, and that is my ring right here, which has the lightning damage, has a 13% chance to stun for 1.5 seconds. And this is huge because it gives you a lot of control over the enemies around you, and you don't take nearly as much damage as you normally would. Now, just, just now, I just got a string of years from the last rift I did. I haven't been able to test it out, but I imagine this will be a huge upgrade for this build since it is so tanky. I also want to point out I'm using a Boom with a Hoarder Legendary Gem which is so much fun to use. There's glow, gold explosions all over the screen, and it, it is, it's visually amazing, and it's a lot of fun just to run around and collect a ton of gold. And I'm trying to level this up to get to, get to rank 25, because the 30% increased speed for two seconds is going to be huge. Uh, I also have these shoulders, which give me a fan and eyes effect uh, when hit, which is nice. A nice shield from these gloves, not game-breaking. And this staff, which is nice, but I don't really use Energy Twister, so it's not too much of a benefit. Okay, I'll show you guys some gameplay of how to play this. Now, as I mentioned, it's a very tanky build. So, you really have to get up and close to the, uh, to the different adds that are around you. I am in Torment 3 right now. I have no issue farming up to Torment 3. I really haven't pushed any further. I imagine I could probably handle Torment 4, but right now I feel comfortable in Torment 3. So, as you can see, I show up. I super massive, I drop my blizzard, and then I just arcane torrent until the enemies go down. As you can see, my health does fluctuate, but for the most part, uh, it's very stable. I have a lot of life on hit. Oh, I guess that got me. But, minus that bad play by me, this build is able to just stand there and take a ton of hits. So I'm going to super massive blizzard and just drop my arcane torrents on the enemies. As you can see, I got this skeleton stun locked right now, which is one of the biggest benefits to this build. I take barely any damage. You just gotta avoid the goo on the ground, which you know, I'm not too great at. And there you go. That's the build. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out. I'm happy to help. Enjoy your time in, in Diablo in the season, and thank you for watching.